the drama. Don't turn around and say that I'm some black hole and I'm dirtier than a cokehead. The resolution. They are or if they're not. Well, Get your name off the bar out. Out. It's all today on Trisha. Joshua didn't deny his kids until Nicole kicked him out. That baby has blue eyes, sandy blonde hair. His skin is as white as hers. How many women did you cheat on me with, Joshua? I didn't cheat on you with none. I'm coming on ex. finding condom wrappers after working all night Never. in front of my doorstep. Oh. Both Joshua and Nicole have found new love. They Wait, call you what? dead because you just suck your and stepped up. You're fake as hell. Don't ever lie. You don't got to lie. DNA may prove he's the dad, but can anyone stop screaming long enough to act like a parent? You're come lying on. because I was there. I was all there. Right, I was paying for it all. all right. You sat on that pancake booty for three years and ain't do nothing. He found a lurid photo online and he swears it's his girlfriend. I see her face and I'm Do like, wait really, a minute. you really, really think that's Veronica? Yeah. I was like, yeah, freckle, freckle beauty yeah, mark. Yeah. Not in that picture, but he swears it's photoshopped. Because it was photoshopped. It's not photoshopped. It was glassy. It was going to take the time to photoshop. Now he's denying their little girl. Why do you doubt Isabella? I caught her cheating. This relationship is a ticking time bomb. He's cheated how many times? Nine that I'm aware of. Nine. Will a double lie detector save it? Have you had sexual intercourse with other women while Veronica is at work? Trisha, this was a very difficult question for me to cover. The polygraph determined. Today on Trisha. This is 22-year-old Nicole. Nicole is here to prove to Joshua, her ex-boyfriend of three years, that her two-year-old son, Josiah, and 15-month-old daughter, Shiley, are in fact his children. Yeah, they're sure cute. Now, up until six months ago, Joshua was proud to be their father. That was until Nicole kicked him out. Now Joshua claims he can't be Josiah's dad because Josiah is too white. And uh, he believes Shiley is another man's baby. So let's start by listening to Nicole's story. When I got together with Joshua, I became pregnant after only a month. He was there for me throughout my entire pregnancy. He was excited to be a dad, and I was excited to start a family. After our son Josiah was born, I became pregnant with our daughter Shiley. Joshua signed both birth certificates and helped with both deliveries. It wasn't until last November when we broke up that he started denying both his kids. He says Josiah looks like a white man's baby, and then I slept around when I got pregnant with Shiley. Since then, he hasn't helped out whatsoever. I would ask him to visit the kids when he wasn't working, and I would have to bribe him with food, gas money, and cigarettes just for him to come see them. Now I have a new man in my life, my fiance Matthew. He has stepped up and filled the void that Joshua left with his kids. Josiah even calls Matthew dad, and Joshua doesn't even care. I know that these two babies belong to him. So once that's proven to him, he needs to make a choice. He's either going to step up and be a father or sign over his rights like he never existed. Wow. Well, also joining us is Nicole's fiance, Matthew, who feels Joshua needs to step up and be a, a dad for his kids. So, Nicole, has Joshua always doubted whether he's the dad? Never, hell Trisha. no, he didn't. Never. That's oh. fake as hell. You're fake as hell. Don't ever lie. You don't gotta lie. This is Melanie. This is Joshua's new girlfriend. You okay? I need to go. I need to go through the issues first with Nicole, and we can't sort it out unless we hear everybody's point of view. Okay. There's three sides to every no. story. Nicole. So he was there when you were pregnant. He was there just every day, every night. He was never away from me one night since September 2009 until November 2012. So, so he wasn't doubting the children? Never, he signed both birth certificates. So when did this start? When did he this start? This started, he had one friend that said, you were only with her for two months. Are you sure you're the dad? He, he always said yes. Because you and felt then, pregnant really quickly. Yeah, after two months. But I guess it only takes one time, right? Yeah, it does, it does. So listen. What I don't understand, everything seemed to be going well with you, and then you kicked him out. Why? He was cheating on me habitually. Every I found more than 25 women 
More than I can't even find Matt on your but Facebook. Let him hey, hey. up because he told me, right? Okay, we will come to you in just a moment. Unless I hear everybody's Those point of view. nothing speak the loudest. Okay, now let's come back to you kicked him out. It sounds to me like there was some kind of uh, real falling out over your car. What what happened there? I lost my license. I transferred my car into his name with okay. an agreement that he would transfer it back when we broke up. Right. And that was the biggest control factor. I had a full-time job. I had two kids to raise in an apartment in my name, and he took off with the car, wouldn't bring me to work. I had to ask him to come see the kids, help me. I can't afford daycare. I'm paying rent and everything by so, myself. So hang on, what do you mean control? He has control issues. He is very insecure. That's why he talked to so many women. Are you absolutely 100% sure that both of those children both are his? Of them. Okay, so, now you also said in that tape package that you actually had to bribe him to come see I the kids. I had to pay him gas. I had to give him cigarettes. I had to give him food just for him to come see his kids. And it took me two months of begging and crying and pleading for him to see them after he was there every single day throughout their entire life. Is, it, is there a possibility that he's not the dad of maybe one of the kids? But, no. Okay. What happened with his taxes? Did you get some money back when that he That was when I, I was begging him to come see the kids. I was begging him. He filed my daughter on his tax return and didn't even ask me if we needed anything. I was giving him money to come see him, and he but filed them on the Did the little girl get you? You would spend that money on the little girl, He didn't right? do anything. He bought another truck and got mine impounded. Wow. It wasn't even in your name. Huh? All right, okay. This is about. I want to remember that this is about two the children and that's cute all little children here. So let's hope everybody's adult enough to talk this through. I think we should hear the other side of the story and hear what Joshua thinks about all this. Why not? Please welcome Joshua. <laughs> know what it is. You'll be crying. No, what do you mean? No, what do you no, mean? no, 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 no. What do you mean you already know what it is? What do you mean You know it? what it is. You're shady as hell, man. Why do you doubt the children? How many women did you cheat on me with, Joshua? I didn't cheat on you with none! When my none, father none. died, I'm you were home, talking to I'm coming to home ex. finding condom wrappers after working all night Never? in front of my doorstep. No, don't even try to run that. You're going to play you that. You were creeping the whole time. Let's talk about why oh, you smart. don't believe these children are yours. I don't Please. believe Josiah's mine. Why? Because we met at a club. Three weeks into us being together, she says she's pregnant. It was not no damn two, two months. months it was three weeks. Why do you have okay. doubts about Shiley? Shiley? I mean, after me and her had a confrontation, we were arguing about Josiah. Mm -hmm. She sends me a text message, and this is real talk, that uh, Shiley might not be yours. I had said, if you have concern no. about anybody, no. The only no, time you're, I cheated you're on lying. you was you're like lying. two months before lying I had like, Shiley. No. Oh, so you no. could, she could have a different no. dad. No, he yeah, had she could have a different dad, and that's what she said. For all I know, Midget we'll Mac Mighty out. Mouse is that kid's dad. Her little punk ass I hope your kids see this. Quote, unquote, fiance that I... Oh, you're talking about Matthew. I was just with her, and all of a sudden, this her fiance? That's when Come I went on. and found you're him. You're lying. After, you're lying. After you're lying. You was right, with him right. the whole Hang time. Hang on, just a minute. Just a minute. Okay. Let's come back to... If you're, I don't, what I don't understand, if you're so angry with Nicole, how come you'd already got with Melanie, but then you go back to Nicole's Look, bed good question. I while go you're back, with her? I go back to Nicole with no intentions on sleeping with her. But did you have sex with her? Yes, I did. <laughs> you're right. I'm sure I did. Why? I did it and I left. Melanie, how old are you? I'm 25. You. Hello. I'm sorry. Me. You're 25 years old. Yeah. I'm a woman of, you know, twice your age. You could be my daughter. And the advice I would give to my daughter, if a man treated my daughter like that, I hope I've raised her right for her to walk away. Yeah. I hope. Okay. Why did you sleep with me then? Yeah, Why did you well, beg me to, to come here? Why did you want to Let's get hear. back with Let's me? Let's hear. Why? I wanted you to be with oh your kids. My God. You, you told me you wanted no, to marry no, me no, when no. we broke up. No, you no. were crying. You weren't already you? knew you were that crying. I was with Melanie when I came over here. Don't act like you, you didn't, come? and that's why you still gave me some. Don't try to act like you ain't no horn with it, slut. But you're saying now you don't believe what? Either of these kids are yours? I don't believe either of them are mine. I what definitely have do? my doubts about Josiah so just me, because of how quick we got together. So let me ask you, I do not know what the DNA tests uh, are going to be. What if the DNA tests come back and say you are the dad of both of these kids? If they come back that I am the apologize? dad... you apologize? I won't apologize because I have valid reasons to feel how I feel. Don't worry okay? about it. The way, the way it popped off with me and her, it happened so fast that... Josiah could be anybody in the Twin Cities damn kid. Yep. Did you, and you know what? Did you, you know use what? precautions? Did the you way, use precautions? No, we didn't use precautions. Why not? But 
That baby has blue ass eyes, sandy blonde hair. Um, his skin is as white as hers. When we come back, we'll meet Matthew. This is the oh, man, man who Nicole Get says up to raise uh, Nicole's two children and we'll also reveal the DNA oh, yeah, test results. So uh, we'll be right back. We'll be right back. Up next. Mac, Mighty Mouse. Why right hate on a guy who's raising your kids? You All want right. to play stepdad? Sucker. And later, he found a lurid photo online and he swears it's his girlfriend. I see her face and I'm Do like, wait really, a minute. you really, really think that's Veronica? Yeah. I have like yeah. a freckle, freckle beauty yeah, mark. Yeah, yeah. Not in that picture, but he swears it's photoshopped. Oh, <laughs> really? Sex, lies, <laughs> and DNA results. Well, well let's find out. Today, today on Twitter. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. All right, all right. Wait, wait. Okay, this is... Hang on just a minute. This is Joshua. And Joshua, you say you grew up without a dad. Oh, yeah. He doesn't know him. Okay, so you're saying you didn't want your kids to be in that situation. Is that exactly? What? But you signed a birth certificate. If and you that's had doubts, why, why sign? Because I wanted, I wanted family. You know, I wanted a family. Are you angry with her because she kicked you out? Oh hell no. <laughs> yes, okay, you go from being with yes, me in February to being engaged to Matthew that probably was in the Real backdrop the whole Real. time. What ultimatum did you want to give Joshua? Um, either way, one way or another, he. I couldn't get him to be a good father even when he was around. E either he way, was too busy with oh, everything else. So, so at the end of the day, you're lying. When the you're lying out, because I was there. I was there. Right, I was about paying yours. for it all. all right. You sat on that pancake booty for three years and they do nothing. And your midget Mac do let him fill these shoes. What are you cause... talking about, Matthew? Oh yeah, midget Mac, Mighty Mouse. Why hate on a guy who's raising your kid? All you right. want to play stepdad? Sucker. Oh, okay. That's fine. Sucker. Well, when the you. test results Hang are revealed, either All right. way. Can we calm down here? Because Matthew's a part of this, and I oh, know, man. I know you know that saying? when Scoop we. Mighty Mouse way over. Yeah, I think we might. Um, <laughs> when we talked to him, one of the things that he said is he wanted you, Joshua, to be more involved in the kids' life. Now, if they are my kids, I'll definitely step up. I've been there. But that's what Matthew. That Just they a are... minute. That is what Matthew's saying. So whatever you think of this guy, the thing he said in the interview with us is that he wanted you to be more around for those kids. It doesn't sound like he's that bad a dude, if that's what no, he's taking care of. Huh? Yeah, yeah. At the end of the day, you're right. Yeah. So I want to talk to him about why he feels like that, and maybe he's heard something the kids have said. He can feel that, that he's only been around for a couple months. Well, let's know. Let's find out. Let's move his seat over here he and let's meet Matthew. He knows Matthew. what she tells him. Relinquish his rights either way. Yeah. Why don't you move? Hi, Matthew. Oh, I'm with you. Oh, 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 all right, all right, all right. All right, Matthew. You Hi. Wanted, Hi. You wanted a family, bro? You lost. You had one. Yo, kids. Yo, kids. You know what? That. You know what? I don't care, dog. They call Please. you dad because you the sucker. Dad. Stepped up oh, to be in. Hey, I've been there. Been there since day one. Right, stepped up. Hey, 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 I want to ask boy. Matthew some a questions. Little while, homeboy. Matthew, mm -hmm. hang on just a minute. Just a minute. You've been around those children for a, a few weeks. That's all it took. What, what, do you, what do you mean that's all it took? What do you think? <laughs> that's what I'm saying. Hang on. Will look, look. you be quiet for what, a moment? What, what yeah. I'm saying is, I've been around him for a few weeks. Both of them already called me dad. This is supposed to be his son. Two and a half years. Yeah. He's supposed to be his dad. His son ain't supposed to call another dude dad within a couple weeks. Oh, he called me weeks. dad that day I was over him. there. No one, no, and then no all, all of a sudden, like where, I'm saying, where, where well, your ring at? You engaged with the ring at? All I'm saying is, because you buy it. We're getting married on the 20th. Because you buy it. Oh, you're getting married? Who's paying for it, though, right? We called the judge. He called me back. We're getting married on. Who's paying for the ring? Whoa, 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 whoa. Why, you know, what is it you've seen that makes you think they need their daddy around? Everybody, every child needs both their parents around in their life. Yeah. Point blank period. So you're saying whether or not you are married to their mom, you still, if, if the period. DNA test, you want him around? Yeah, just because they're his kids. I want him to relinquish if rights immediately. Yeah, I mean, okay. if they're my kids. That, no, if, if, they're, if they are or if they're point not, blank. get well, your name off the birth certificate. Well, let's find out if they are. Nothing off for hey, nothing. hey, let's. Because I'll get joint custody if they're mine, oh, point blank. Boy, oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. Oh, wait, if I get the DNA results, is anybody going to be, or I, let me ask you, Joshua, are you going to be quiet enough for us to see them? Yep. Okay, thank you very much. So let's get the DNA test results. Yeah. Um, so, Shiley, I can read them. So, okay, 
Okay, you say you're sure that I can read. Please this read is them. shyly, and I don't know what's in this, so I'm just reading from Please here. Read it. Okay. The DNA result determined that Joshua. Coming up, let's find out about your little boy Josiah. Yeah. Here we go. The DNA results determined that Joshua. <laughs> up next. He found a lurid photo online and he swears it's his girlfriend. I see her face and I'm like, wait really, a minute. Do you really, really think that's Veronica? Yeah. I have like yeah. a freckled Freckle. beauty mark. Yeah, yeah. Not in that picture, but he swears it's photoshopped. Oh, <laughs> really? Sex, lies, and DNA results. Well, well let's find out. Out. Today on Twitter. <laughs> 19-year-old Veronica. Now, Veronica fell in love with William when she was just 16. And they have a 19-month-old daughter together. Aww. But, sadly, it's been three long years of infidelity, bitter accusations and non-stop fighting. <laughs> now, recently, things got even worse when William found an online photo of a woman who he believes is Veronica in a, how should I say this, a compromising position with another man <laughs> now this situation has become critical and their innocent baby is paying the price so let's listen first to Veronica's side of the story William and I have been together for four years and we have a 19 month old daughter Isabella together I was only 16 when I started dating Will and we were great together and then the cheating started Will's cheated on me nine times that I know about but I've only cheated on him once. Every time I come in contact with another man in any way, he thinks I'm cheating on him. To make things even worse, his friend showed him a picture of a girl performing oral sex on the internet, and he swears that it's me. I can't believe that all his accusations and mistrust towards me is making him deny his own daughter, and now he's asking for a DNA test. Even his own mother knows that our daughter is his, and he needs to man up, because I just can't take this anymore. Okay, now I want everyone to know that William's mother, Kristen, is here in our audience and you'll be surprised to find out whose side she's on. But let's talk to Veronica first. Veronica, both of you have taken polygraph tests. That's correct. Okay, yeah. so this is a matter of who's cheating. Now let's start with William. He's cheated how many times? Nine that I'm aware of. Wow. Nine. So, when did you become aware of these nine times? Did you, did you hear about them all in one go or over the years or how's that? He's told me over the past four years, um, sometimes right after, sometimes weeks after, sometimes months after. So, hang on, you've forgiven this guy nine times? Not necessarily forgiven, but I've tried to get past it. I mean, we've tried to get past it nine times. <laughs> so, so, why wouldn't you, why are you here? Why wouldn't you try to get past it another nine times? Why not? Because now it's not entirely a matter of getting past what he's done. It's to prove to him that, one, the picture that he's seen isn't me as uh, much uh, as he's wait, 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 Let me stop you there. So he's cheated on you nine times, but the yes. real reason is here because he saw a picture on the internet he thinks is you. Yes. And so you, you, haven't, you haven't dragged him here nine times, but the one time he's doubtful about you, here we are. Well, it's, it's been doubtful. I don't get that. You know, it's not fair. He's doubted me for, I don't know what, the past... Three years? Oh. I mean, it started three years ago, accusations, mistrust, everything. And that's more of what, from what he says, led him to cheat on me is because he felt like I was doing it. So what, who started cheating? But how first? many they times were you not together when he did cheat, which isn't cheating because ah. you broke up with him? Now, what about your little girl? Is it, does he doubt that he's the dad? Yes. Why, were you with he, somebody else around that time? He feels like the, I, I was seeing, not necessarily seeing I was talking to someone else. Talking. Two months prior when I stopped. Two months prior to when we conceived, never had an intimate relationship with him. So is that never. why he doubts he's the he, dad? He feels like I so had an intimate talking? relationship, yes. What's talking? What's your I, version of talking? We work together. Yeah. So we would talk. It was someone I had to vent to. I kissed him to keep him around. It never went further than that. Why he wouldn't it go further than that? Because I wasn't... I was never, here. I was never, the, never before William had I cheated on anybody. Ever, none of my exes, nothing. After seven different people, we split up. I had sex with one person, one okay. time. That's not me. 
So let's talk about this picture. What is this picture on, on the internet that he seems to think is you being orally intimate with a guy? Very um, indecent photo. Very indecent photo? She wanted very... to send it to me, and then my son did. Why does he think it's you? He feels like the eyebrows, the face structure, everything is me. But yet the one thing in the picture, the girl does it. What's, under, what's underneath my chin? You got a mole? I, yeah, I have like yeah. a freckle, freckle beauty mark. Yeah, yeah. Not in that picture, but he swears it's photoshopped. Oh, really? <laughs> You and Kristen, Kristen, you get al you seem to be getting along. Do you think that Isabella is your son? So, uh, are oh, your yes. grandma? Yes. No doubt. No so doubt. So you, you don't well, share his. She was stuff. pregnant. Yes, we did. She's not my daughter. He's my son. They didn't live together right. when she got pregnant. So yes, in the whole beginning of the pregnancy and everything, and while she was a very little baby, we did say that they should get a paternity test to prove 100%. But now she's a little bit older. You're oh, looking. Oh, she's got all his features. Yeah? yeah. What do you think of their relationship? It's like Jekyll and Hyde. <laughs> yeah. Like One day, day. It's, night and day. It's been, yeah. it's been a ticking time bomb for the past yeah. three years. And what do you think Jekyll this ticking Hyde. time bomb is doing to your granddaughter? She she gets put a lot in the middle. She's almost like the tug of war toy, in a way, you know. And that's bad. Yeah. So, why do you think you're being accused of cheating? Do you think it's because he's guilty? I think it's because he feels bad. I not necessarily feels bad but because he's done so much it's that tit for tat i feel like she's doing something so i'm going to do something then they i did something so each other so much all the time of cheating on one another and doing something wrong i'm surprised they both ain't doing something every single day yeah <laughs> all right so two sides to every story let's hear william's side of things in the beginning of my relationship with veronica it was absolute heaven but it quickly became hell I want to be able to trust Veronica and have her trust me. I admitted cheating on Veronica nine times in the past, but I told her about it. I really think Veronica wants to be somewhere else. She just don't look at me the same. My friend showed me a picture, and it was a girl giving another guy oral sex. Right away, I knew it was Veronica. Now her actions have me denying my own daughter is Bella. These tests are our last hope to save a relationship. Let's meet the guy himself. Let's bring William out. Come on out. Up next. You fuck with that many people or done things with that many people. I've only been with three. So many times. And you would turn around and say that I'm some black hole and I'm dirtier than a cokehead. Something else. And later. Can I get you to be there for him? do that. You're lying Whoa. through your teeth. I've been here. Sex, lies, and DNA results. Well, let's find out. Today on Trisha. William and I have been together for four years, and we have a 19-month-old daughter, Isabella, together. Will's cheated on me nine times that I know about, but I've only cheated on him once. To make things even worse, his friend showed him a picture of a girl performing oral sex on the internet, and he swears that it's me. I can't believe that all his accusations and mistrust towards me is making him deny his own daughter, and now he's asking for a DNA test. My friend showed me a picture and it was a girl giving another guy oral sex. Right away, I knew it was Veronica. Now her actions have me denying my own daughter is Bella. These tests are our last hope to save a relationship. Let's meet the guy himself. Let's bring William out. Come on out. Hi. So, William, you've cheated how many times? Nine times. Nine times. Why? Well, when, did, when, did you, when did you first cheat? First cheated probably... 11 months into a relationship because she left me at the nine month mark and started dating an employee that she was working with. We had broken up. I had started seeing someone else. So that was the first one? The first one. Yeah, the other eight? And then it, <laughs> it the beginning was heaven and the ending. It, the so whole, why, why do you keep, the rest why do you just, keep cheating on her? She's spiteful. I feel like... Why is she spiteful? How am I spiteful? If you've slept with that many people or done things with that many people, I've only been with three. so many times. But why is that? And then said, oh, I'm done. I'm going to go be with somebody else. But why is that? And you turn around and say that I'm some black hole and I'm dirtier than a cokehead. Something else. Drugs are part of this, are they? Or were a part of this? They were. They were. In the past, yeah. So, nine times. When was the last time you cheated? About six months ago. You knew that, right? Yes. What's the longest you two have been without one of you cheating on the other? <laughs> Me 
see it three years. Yeah, I believe that. Uh, uh, what, you six never believe that. Weeks? You never believe anything. How long, how long do you go within with that? The, within all the years you guys Sorry? have been together, hang on, just, this, what, what oh. month have you actually not broken up? Well, well hang on. Just, we break up like once a day. Once a day. We but we like have... Did you but tell me, hang on, you said the longest, the longest you've not cheated for is about two months? Three. Three months? Wow! <laughs> 90 days. So tell me why you're together. And if you say love, I'm going to scream blue murder, because this is not. <laughs> this is codependency. This is I'm scared of being on my own. This is uh, I want to come back to where I belong. Uh, now, why do you doubt Isabella? Before she was pregnant, she... I caught her cheating with her phone. I looked through her phone because she had it in my pocket. She put it in my pocket when we went to Kohl's. And I looked through it and I miss your lips and I miss your kisses and there was a comma oh. in between. Wow. What, what was that about? He, so you miss he him. feels like, oh. yes, yeah. Yeah. he feels right. like that that's the one that when cool. I was it working was, with, kissed him, kissing. talked to him, never had sex with him, never touched him, he never touched me like that. Then why would he, he say it like that? Oh, then right. why would he say it like he, that? He takes everything in a negative direction. Do you still deny Good little girl, do you still deny Isabella? Have you been there for her? You... Either way, I became Mr. Mom. I stay at home with her all the time. Is that a bit of resentment, or you're happy being Mr. Mom? I'm happy about that. You're happy being that. Good. Um... <laughs> all right, so both of you done lie detector tests. What happens... What ha let, me ask, let me ask you for this first, Veronica. What happens if he fails any part of the lie detector test, then, then what? We're going to have some, well, more serious issues than no, what we have come now. come on. Not like You're not going to... other day. It's all right. Yeah. <laughs> so it's going to be, you know, so it's going to be the score, isn't it? He's like, uh, Tim uh, Acosta is oh, going to be our score. who back. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And, and what it, if she fails like the that. lie detector test? I'll be done. Well, if you're keeping score, isn't she allowed some kind of another six times or something like that? I expect it. I expected ah. it. We broke up so many times. The last one he first started hooking up with, which I do know, we when up. they were not together. And you said you're going to be with somebody. She left him, said, we ain't living together no more. That's it. How, how now, how do how you, you cheat be, on somebody ha, when we're not together? Gonna sit there and deal with what My I son is not years. no mind reader. He is not going to know, you know when this she's like, done and not. This but is like the young and the restless. He goes on and on and on and on and on. For the last four years. Tell me. Tell me about this picture online. I look at it and I'm like, wait a minute. What the And I see her. I see her face and I'm like, wait a minute. Do you really, really think that's Veronica? Yeah. When do you think she did this? And where? With who? Why was it shown to me and why does it when, look like her? Is there any chance he's not Isabella's dad? Let's, let's get no, that there's No, there's no chance that he's not. No chance. All right, so let's come to the DNA test results. Let's do that first before we get to the polygraph. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Uh, who wants to open this? You? 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 Yeah. I don't know what it says, so I'm going to excuse me for looking over your shoulder. Coming up, we ask you, oh, have you down. had sexual intercourse with other women while Veronica is at work? Trisha, this was a very difficult question for me to cover. William said no, the polygraph determined. Oh. And later. Let's find out about your little boy, Josiah. Here we go. The DNA results determined that Joshua... Oh. Sex, lies, and DNA results. Well, well let's the find out. Today on Trisha. William and I have been together for four years, and we have a 19-month-old daughter, Isabella, together. Will's cheated on me nine times that I know about, but I've only cheated on him once. To make things even worse, his friend showed him a picture of a girl performing oral sex on the internet, and he swears that it's me. I can't believe that all his accusations and mistrust towards me is making him deny his own daughter, and now he's asking for a DNA test. My friend showed me a picture, and it was a girl giving another guy oral sex. Right away, I knew it was Veronica. Now her actions have me denying my own daughter is Bella. These tests are our last hope to save a relationship. What's the longest you two have been without one of you cheating on the other? Three. Three months? Wow! 90 days! What it, if she fails like the that. lie detector test? I'll be done. So, let's come to the DNA test results. Let's do that first before we get to the polygraph. Thank you. Thank you. 
right, you're welcome. Uh, who wants to open this? You? 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 Yeah. I don't know what it says, so I'm going to excuse me for looking over your shoulder. Oh. <laughs> yes, he is. <laughs> to test results, see where the score is at with these oh. uh, So Tim Acosta is with us. Tim? Yeah. All right, so let's see whose results we have. First of all, we have William's lie detector results. Oh, OK. God. William, we asked you, do your friends influence you to cheat on Veronica? You said yes. <laughs> Tim? Trisha the polygraph determined that William was being truthful. We asked you, do you believe the woman having oral sex in the picture your friends showed you <laughs> is Veronica? And you said yes. Tim? The polygraph determined that William was being truthful. You really believe it is? Oh, yeah, he does. Uh, I'm not going to applaud that because we don't know. William, we asked you, oh, do you text other women for sex? Do you think he does that? Yeah. He had, well, he did while we were broke, like, broken up the most recent time. Right. Right, you said no. Tim, what did the lie detectors show? Trisha, this question covered while they were together. I made sure he understood that. Oh. The polygraph determined that William was being truthful. Oh! oh. William, we asked you, bring have you had sexual intercourse with other women while Veronica is at work that she doesn't know about? You said no. Tim? The polygraph determined that William was being truthful. Not being horrible, William, but why would you have to lie about nine, you know? <laughs> While in a relationship with Veronica, have you had any sexual contact with anyone other than the women she knows about? You said no. Tim? Trisha, this was a very difficult question for me to cover with William. I ran several charts just to make sure that my decision was correct. William said no. The polygraph determined that William was being truthful. <gasps> detector test results you better be ready for the truth okay Veronica we asked you is that you in the picture giving oral sex to a stranger that Williams friend found on the internet you said no Tim the polygraph determined that Veronica was being truthful <laughs> Kissing the man from work. Did you have any sexual intercourse with him? You said no, Tim. The polygraph determined that Veronica was being truthful. <laughs> Veronica, we asked you, have you ever had sexual contact with any of William's friends? Oh, please, not the same friends. We're not talking. <laughs> <laughs> yes, the same friends. Please. Please. All, oh, yes. all of them. All of them. You said no, no. Tim. The polygraph determined that Veronica was being truthful. <laughs> Veronica, <laughs> while this is in a one. relationship with William, have you had any sexual contact with anyone other than the man you admitted to? You said no, Tim. The polygraph determined that Veronica was being truthful. What we've ascertained from this is this will continue unless you really get some talking therapies or some assistance to deal with that. This was a big milestone yeah, step for us. Well, you two I have never it... had intimacy. You two have always had a sex. dangerous relationship. Hello. That was sex and fun and dangerous Thank and fighting. You. you need to have the intimacy part. And hopefully this will put everything from yeah. your past that it's you accused. It's a good accused. start. It's another start. Yes. Because you're right. They get. I said, is this the young and the restless? You get. You you get hooked on the drama. <gasps> oh, she cheated on me. She didn't. My friends. Oh, oh, you know. <laughs> Real life can be quite mundane, but if you're content and if you're at peace with your soul, that doesn't matter. Because this, the mouth and the mind and the heart, is what keeps couples together. Not that not down that there. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And Veronica. When we forgive and forgive and forgive and forgive and forgive and forgive, you invite them to do it again. <laughs> when he knows, when he knows the next time he crosses that line, 
There is only one way, however much it hurts you, there's only one way that the door goes. And if you walk, step over that line into another woman's bedroom, you just keep on moving. <laughs> OK? Up next, let's find out about your little boy, Josiah. Here we go. The DNA results determined that Joshua... <laughs> Sex, lies, and DNA results. Well, Italy let's the find out. Today on Trisha. When I got together with Joshua, I became pregnant after only a month. After our son Josiah was born, I became pregnant with our daughter Shiley. Joshua signed both birth certificates and helped with both deliveries. It wasn't until last November when we broke up that he started denying both his kids. Now I have a new man in my life, my fiance Matthew. He has stepped up and filled the void that Joshua left with his kids. You're shady as hell, man. Why do you doubt the children? How many women did you cheat on me with, Joshua? I didn't cheat on you with none! When my none, father none. died, you were talking to your I'm coming home finding condom wrappers after working all night Never. in front of my doorstep. Let's talk about why oh, you smart. don't believe these children are yours? I Please. don't believe Josiah's mine Why? because we met at a club. Three weeks into us being together, she says she's pregnant. It was not we no damn two, two months. months it we was three weeks. I love you. Okay. I'm wrong with no, you. All right. Your kids, your kids you know probably what? that. You know what? I don't care, dog. They, they call do you dead because you just suck your and I'm stepped up. Because I'll get joint custody if they mind oh, point blank. Boy, oh. I Okay, you say you're sure that I can read Please this? Read is them. Shiley, and I don't know what's in this, so I'm just reading from Please here. Read it. Okay. The DNA result determined that Joshua is Shiley's father. Yeah. Tell me something I don't know. Now. Okay. All right, Thank let's you. find out. Now, there are different concerns about each child. Shiley is your little girl. Let's find out about your little boy, Josiah. Yeah. This one. You Me again. Please. Wow, I get all the good jobs. <laughs> okay, here we go. The DNA results determined that Joshua is Josiah's father. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Those two little I've been waiting for this day, Trisha. Thank you. I've been waiting for this day. I came in for one thing only, and that was to get the truth. Now, like I said, I've had real reasons to have my doubts, okay, and any no. dude in my position would have had the same doubts, knowing the situation. I'm going to court to have him relinquish custody. What? Ah, yes. Boy, Hang on a minute. I can't even, do that. even get you to be there can't for him. do that. You're lying Whoa. through your teeth. I've been here. Nicole, you came here to do a DNA test <laughs> to prove to him that in those, the world. hang on, that he, and the world, that those kids are his. So you go through all of that, you get the answer, you say, thank you, I've got the information I need. And then you turn around and say, I'm not going to let you see them anyway. What the Why hell have you wanted? He didn't want to see them anyway. She never wanted to see them. I was She wants me to relinquish custody, but she was just texting me and calling me while I was in the to see them room before I do to it. come see them you, How many times have you asked about get your kids? Out of here. We'll take a break. We'll be right back. Sex, lies, and DNA results. Well, let's find out. Today on Trisha. I want to thank you for watching. And I think it is true, you know, the toughest thing in life is being intimate with your mouth and with your heart and with your soul and with your mind. Anyone can be intimate with that, as our guests keep showing us. But take care. <laughs>